We're still talking transfers on Soccer Bites. Aki, yesterday we were, well, I don't know if you were stunned or amazed. Ezekiel Bassi from Aimba to Barcelona. Uh, that was one of the biggest deals of a transfer deadline day. Uh, he, he was seen, when, when the news broke, some people thought it was a lie until we saw pictures and videos of him having medicals at Camp Nou. Uh, he was signed by Barcelona on loan. We'll be going back, but it depends on what happens this season. Uh, so, how did this? How did you take this news? No, I was surprised, just like many of us. I was shocked, and uh, when I heard it on radio, I was shocked, and at the same time, I was excited. I was excited for many reasons. I was excited for the young boy to move from Ayimba to Barcelona, arguably the biggest club side in the world. Um, I was excited that um, Barcelona scouts are actually out there looking at the Nigerian league because that means there's a lot of opportunities for everyone out there, irrespective of the club side you're playing for. So you don't actually have to go to a maybe lower rung club. You know, there used to be this belief that you got to go to maybe Holland first or you go to Norway before first you or you go to, before you find yourself in a top in, club. In England, but that actually... Well, I, I think it's actually a result of the partnership. There's a new yeah, partnership, yeah, the yeah, La Liga yeah, and the MPFL. Yeah, so, I know. So we probably give kudos to the LMC. Also. Absolutely. I've always given, given kudos to the LMC, to the Nigerian Football Association. It's a tough work they're doing out there. Um, they've got, they, they make mistakes and we criticize them rightly so. Right. But definitely they're doing their best and um, Nigerian football is kind of, kind of moving forward. All right. Ezekiel was uh, on that uh, tour of Spain mm. um, sometime last year when the MPFL All-Stars went to Spain. So Obviously, he was spotted. Uh, well, the snag here that is making people raise eyebrows is that uh, Ezekiel is said to be 20 years. Yeah. Do you have any issue with that? What's wrong with being 20? No, like a 20-year-old playing for Aimba. Now, everyone just hopes that, you know, it's probably his right age and all that. Well, we hope he's his right age, but there's no reason to not believe it's his right age, except we have something to counter it. We, we, right. we just can't sit down here and hear that someone in Abba is 20. I would say, no, he's not 20. We we'll probably never have seen his picture. We've we'll never seen him in real life. We don't know his friends. We don't know his family. We we'll just assume because that's what everybody says. So we just say he's not 20. That's very unfair. But if we've got facts to, to, to prove that he's not 20, then we can start looking into it. But we just have to accept it. He's a young guy, I believe, and he's got, I believe he's got a great picture. I've never seen him, seen him play, but I believe he's got a great picture. Incidentally, he, just, he played last week, you know, uh, for Aimba against Abio Warriors. And, uh, you know, no one thought he would be at Barcelona. He, joined the, he joins the likes of uh, Benga Okunowo in the past, Emmanuel Amunike. Uh, how, how do you predict his time at Barcelona will be? Well, a lot of people will say it will never break into the... In, in the top, but you never can tell. Um, he's been signed at the, the, the B team. Yeah. That's expected. It's going to be almost impossible to bring a young star from him and walk straight, straight into the first team of Barcelona. That's going to be almost impossible. So, but that's the, he has to go through the ranks. And there are many other players he's going to meet there. So there's no guarantee. There are many Spaniards, there are many young Definitely. players from Brazil, Argentina, that are in the youth team as well. So there's no guarantee that all of them, all of them will not get in the first team. That's so there's right. no guarantee that he's going to get into the first team as well. But we'll hope that the way Bengal Konawa did it and got to the first team. We hope the way uh, Aminike was brushed into the first team. But look at Kelechi Hana and in Man City. When he got signed at Man City, a lot of people thought, okay, it's going to be difficult yeah, for him yeah, to yeah, play yeah, in the first team. Good. Fine, it's not the number one choice for the number nine shirt but he's worked his waist in the first quarter so we'll hope for the best and we'll hope the guy can do it all right we definitely hope uh, Ezekiel Bassi uh, can do it he has only five months to do it so uh, enjoy your time at Barcelona and uh, we hope for the best and the best being that Bassa would say hey you're good we want to keep you so all the best Ezekiel Bassi